I don't really remember when I first started painting. I know that I first started drawing, my parents said before I could even walk. I've always been uh, inspired by music. I've been a DJ for many years. I started off as reggae. My artwork is a combination of personal experience and culture and, and world. I mean, I use photographs, I use mythology, I use my dreams, I use observation. There's nothing um, that I'm not going to do if I feel like I want to do it. If I, if I you know, want to paint or draw something, I'm just going to do it. I'm not going to worry about whether I can or not. Somebody once said that to me, that what they like about my drawings is that I'm not afraid to draw anything, and I'm not afraid to draw anything. Artwork, ultimately, I mean, I'm very serious about my artwork, but by the same token, I have immense fun with it, and it's always a source of fun. And, you know, to get too serious about it and, you know, have intellectual pretense and talk about process and all that crap is just so alien to me and it's just repugnant and I'm just doing it for fun which makes sense because they're not selling if I'm not having fun <laughs> I really what am I doing you know but you can see what fun I'm having right here so I draw in these 9 by 12 inch books which I later shrink down to release as zines and uh, if, when I get a drawing that I particularly like, in terms of its composition, I'll make it into a painting. I spend a lot of time doing the pencil part of the drawing before I ink it in. I'm going to, if I have to, erase and erase and erase until I get the particular detail right, whether it's a hand or a foot or placing it on the right place on the page or whatever it is. If I don't have it completely the way I want it before I ink it, I'm not going to ink it. So that requires a lot of concentration, a lot of uh, planning and a lot of time. A large amount of my uh, paintings and drawings are experiments. I'm always trying to push the envelope a little bit, trying to do something different. You can see I'm painting with my fingers too. So not only am I painting with cardboard, I'm painting with my fingers. So these are finger paintings, these are cardboard paintings. These are not what you would call your regular sort of like, you know, professional kind of thing. So there was a direct, you know, correlation between my music interests and my painting. And they've always been parallel. I mean, I'm always uh, listening to music while I paint. You know, I've always been having the one sort of feed the other, you know, sort of pollinate the other. And uh, I don't know how anybody could paint without music. Half the reason I do my radio shows is that I know I'll have a, I record them, I'll have a good soundtrack to listen to when I'm uh, painting. So, when I come into the station, I come into the record library and I start pulling things which I could use. I couldn't get in a better groove than the music that I like. I'm still having so much fun with it that it's still fresh to me and it's, it's not like I'm repeating myself. I think the most rewarding thing is just uh, completing it and to my satisfaction because I don't really, <clears throat> you know, when you do artwork nobody applauds at the end of it. It's just basically to, uh, to have a good time and push myself, push the envelope, and do something different.